body my view hey guys hey family welcome back to my youtube channel first of all i just wanted to say thank you all for all the likes um thanks for watching my first video this is my second one and before i start it's make sure you press the like subscribe and the notification button so you know when i upload my videos first of all i just wanted to say thank you to everyone who's been watching my video i love you all appreciate it you know i actually appreciate it so let's get right into this video so i thought to myself do you know what let me be honest transparent with my viewers and my family and yeah so it's something that i want to share that's very personal to me and i thought you know well, why not do it right at the beginning so i know that there's a lot of transparency there and whoever this video is for to help out there can help someone out there so i know in my introduction video i said my my channel is going to be about weight loss journey and today specifically this video is going to be talking about weight loss and what i've done to <laughs> be where i'm at today i can't believe it's so difficult to come out <gasps> come out come out come out okay guys here is it i i had I had weight loss surgery, so I had a VSG. I don't know why there's such a shame or a stigma to it, but I ain't ashamed of it, girl. That shit is changing my life. So let's get serious here, yeah. I had a VSG um, on the 10th of August, 2020, during the pandemic, and it was a decision that I took very seriously because I, during the pandemic, it actually helps me realize that, you know what? what i have got an issue like i'm addicted to food and i've been trying to lose weight for years and it isn't coming up and after three kids i just felt like i needed that extra push i needed that extra support to actually help me and aid me towards my weightless journey so on the 10th of august i got a gastric sleeve and i am six weeks post up now um sorry <laughs> I am six weeks post op, yeah. So pre op, I'm still getting used to like the language and all of that, you know. So I'm still learning. So pre op, so before the surgery, I weighed uh, 138, and six weeks down now, I am 121.1. So within six weeks, I've actually lost almost 20 kg, and like that's something that would have never happened like i'm telling you i'm that girl that will say to you you know tomorrow i'm starting that diet so today i will stuff myself i will eat cookies brownies chocolate because you know what girl tomorrow i'm starting my diet but that tomorrow come and i never start like i never start like i always struggle with you know starting the diet so i'll probably wake up in the morning and say today i'm gonna start my diet and then by 12 o'clock i'll probably get a little stressed and I'm stuffing my face. So I've had, like, <sighs> it's been difficult and challenging for me. So, and, and I've done a lot of research into gastric sleeve. And, um, yeah, it was the best surgery for me. And it was the best decision I've ever done because I'm actually losing weight. I'm feeling happier within myself. Girl, if you're not happy about your weight, yeah, you need to change it. And I'm not saying go and get surgery, weight loss surgery or VSG, although it can help you. But you need to do something to change that because if you're not happy within your weight and yourself, you can't you can't excel in anything else you do because that's always gonna hold you down. Like I was always not happy with my weight. Like I feel like I was a lot slimmer when I was in school. But like since when I started having kids, like it's just been continuous, continuous, continuous and, and I could not lose the weight. So, and I know I was like to myself, if I don't do nothing now, in the next three, four years, I'm probably going to be that woman that can't even leave her bed, that can't run in the park with her kids, that can't do anything with her kids, that's always tired because of the weight. And I know there get ladies out there that are happy with their weight and they love it, you know, to us to you guys and I, and that's confident. But i believe if you're not happy with something you change it you know so back to the topic i'm always talking off topic guys so yeah i had a gastric sleeve and i am losing weight i'm gonna do another video 
of the process where I got it done and if you have any questions guys you can always put in a comment and I'm always open to answer questions or any video you want me to do regarding my VSG surgery I'm happy to do it and um <laughs> talk for days i don't want this video to be too long so i'm currently losing like people are saying to me your face looks slimmer you know i am i thought i'm a bit harder myself so it's like people saying you're losing weight but i can't see it like i think if if it isn't drastic weight loss where i'm like maybe a size 10 or something i'm probably gonna still see myself as being fat you know a body dysmorphia thing but girl listen but you know i feel a lot more energy i feel happier like i wake up in the morning and i and i want to go for a walk i want to go for a jog i want to go for a run you know it's really helped me reset my mentality and it's helped me reset my mentality how i see food what i think about food and and you'll be so surprised how life-changing this experience is <laughs> and guys you'll be so surprised how life-changing this is but if you want me go and, I, and i'm located in the uk guys so if you want to ask any questions i will do a video of how the surgery went what happened prior to the surgery a full detail but i just thought you know what I need to be transparent with my audience i need to you know from the beginning be transparent and view that network and that family you know and um yeah so guys the moral of the story is i had a, a weight loss surgery it's called the gastric sleeve you can google that so it's when they cut i'm gonna um insert the picture of it here it's when they cut your stomach so they cut 80 percent of your stomach and technically you only have like 20 percent left so you don't feel very hungry even when you eat like you can only eat two spoons max i'm telling you you can only eat two spoons of whatever you're trying to eat <sighs> you know there are there are ups and downs to it but ultimately i'm happy with the decision that i made and guys you need to do your research i did a lot of research i prayed about it I uh, spoke to my husband, spoke to my family and they were all supportive. I had a very supportive network that actually supported me through the whole process. And I think that's what made it easier for me. And actually in the decision making as well, I had to pray about it a lot because I don't like to do things without God saying, okay, even do it. You know, a surgery is a major life changing thing. Listen, you're getting put to sleep, like you could easily die from it and stuff. So you need to really be at peace with that decision before you go for it. But guys, if you're out there and you're really struggling with your weight, there's so many things you can do to kind of help you but you know i chose i know people might think it's the easy way out but girl it ain't the easy way out because i still have to exercise as y'all i still have to eat healthy so isn't it just cutting my stomach and i can just eat whatever i want there's something i can't even eat like i can't eat more than two spoons so there are it's not the easy way out but it just kind of helps you especially when you when you're when you're addicted to food because girl i'm addicted to food like I had to just get to a point where I own it to myself that Evelyn you know this is an addiction like I, I love food like I just uh, yeah I love food so and and I think this surgery actually has helped me to you know control my portions really think about what I'm putting into my body like girl if that shit ain't gonna help me it ain't going in here because this stomach is going to reject so i'm going to be throwing up so I, i've probably spoken so much and i've just mixed everything all up but to end this because i don't want this video to be too long i'm going to do another video on this um i'm going to do another video on how the surgery went and um, things you should really know about it this is just obviously an introduction not an introduction just to let you know and have that transparency in, when, when, in, in case you see me in my next video and i'm looking slim 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 like a slim thing <laughs> i'm looking skinny like a skinny bitch but so yeah so you know and um remember to like and subscribe and press the notification button for my next video and thank you for watching guys bye bye